So if you've been watching the AI space lately, you know it's been crowded with tools that promise everything but don't really deliver. But Abacus AI's Deep Agent is different. It's a powerful all-purpose AI teammate built right into Chat LLM, and it's already turning heads. And in this video, I'll walk you through what makes Deep Agent so impressive, including how it can build an entire website from a single text prompt, generate fully designed PowerPoint decks from just one idea, analyze documents, and even automate multi-step workflows. And whether you're a content creator, startup founder, or just exploring what's next in AI, this tool is something you wanna check out. And real quick, before we get started, if you get any value out of this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to the Blog Within YouTube channel. Helps me bring you more resources, and it keeps you up to date with all of the AI, web, and tech trends happening throughout the year. But either way, thank you so much for all your support. All right, with that being said, let's get started. All right, to begin, head over to the Deep Agent homepage. I've included a link to this in the video description below. And from here, click the Get Started button. And that'll launch the signup flow for Chat LLM Teams, which is the platform Deep Agent runs on. Next, you'll choose your signup method. You could use Apple, Google, or Microsoft, or simply enter your name, email, and password. In my case, I'm just gonna use my Google account. And then after that, you'll be prompted to name your organization. This is essentially your workspace and you can change the name later on if needed. I'm naming this Blog with Ben to keep everything organized under my brand. And then once your organization is created, you'll see a prompt to enter your card details. And as I mentioned earlier, Deep Agent is a part of the Chat LLM Teams subscription, which starts at $10 per user per month. And you'll be billed right away whenever you sign up, but the good news is you can cancel any time and your access will stay active for the remainder of the month. If you need more power and fewer limits, you can also upgrade to the Pro tier for an additional $10 per month. That gives you more unrestricted access to Deep Agent and allows you to run as many tasks as you want as long as your account has compute credits. All right, after subscribing, you'll be taken into the Chat LLM Teams interface. And from here, you'll wanna look for the black banner at the top that says Deep Agent Try Now and click on that to launch the Deep Agent experience. If the banner doesn't show up for some reason, you could always find Deep Agent in the bottom left corner of your sidebar under the tools section. And both of those will take you to the Deep Agent dashboard and you'll land on a clean interface with the simple prompt box at the center. This is where you could start giving instructions and then below that, you'll see some tasks that you can explore, things like creating a PowerPoint or building a website or even planning a luxury trip. These are all great ways to get familiar with the kind of jobs Deep Agent can handle. But before we dive into actually using Deep Agent, here are a couple quick tips that'll make your experience a little smoother. First, if you ever need help figuring out what Deep Agent can do or how to write better prompts, just click the help and how to link located directly below the prompt box. And this will take you to a full guide that explains how Deep Agent works, what type of tasks it can complete, and what kind of input it needs from you. It also gives you tips on structuring your prompts clearly, which is key to getting high quality results. Second, if you prefer working in a dark mode like I do to kind of save my old eyes, you can change that easily. If you head back to the dashboard, just click your profile avatar in the upper right corner, and this will open the settings, and then just toggle the theme from light to dark. Again, this is especially useful if you're working late or just want to reduce eye strain. Okay, now that we've signed up, explored the dashboard, and adjusted our settings, let's run our first task with Deep Agent and see what it can really do. So for the first example, I'm gonna use one of the pre-made tasks from the Deep Agent dashboard there. And for this first example, I'm gonna use the Book Club website sample task. And when you click on that, a pop-up will appear showing you the prompt that it uses. In this case, it's create a website about a book club and pick 12 books to talk about. There's even a short how-to video included. If you want a quick visual overview before diving in, it's a nice touch. But we're just gonna dive in and see what this can do. So. Go ahead and click the try it button to launch this task. And the deep agent immediately gets to work and starts evaluating the prompt. And this takes a few seconds, so just sit tight really quick while it does its thing. 
And then it may ask you a few follow-up questions to clarify the vision for your site. And for this one, it asks for a book club name, the genre we want to focus on, and whether we want any specific features included, like discussion forums or reading schedules. And then you'll want to answer these questions in the prompt box below. And I just numbered them, but you could also say you decide for anything you want the AI to handle on its own. And then I ended up telling it to go with fiction for the genre. And then again, I left the rest up to the deep agent to decide. Okay, then once your responses are submitted, you'll see the deep agent begin gathering information in planning the build. And then you're probably gonna hear me say this a couple times in this video, but while it is working and processing all the information and evaluating the prompt, it takes a few minutes for it to fully finish. So it's gonna be fetching book cover images, organizing the layout and writing all the supporting content, but you get to watch it build the site in real time, which is really cool. However, it does take a few minutes for it to fully process. So you do kind of have to sit tight while it does its thing. And for the sake of time, I'm gonna be fast forwarding through a lot of this processing. So I just want you to know that what may seem like a few seconds in this video typically takes about 60 to 90 seconds to fully complete. So just FYI. And the interface will shift slightly. On the left, you'll see the conversation and the task details. And then on the right, you'll see the website taking shape. This part takes, again, a few minutes. So I'm gonna fast forward a bit here, but in real time, it's surprisingly a quick process when compared to having to build this out on your own. Okay, then once the task is complete, you'll get a confirmation message in the chat panel on the left. And then on the right, you'll see the finished site. And in this example, Deep Agent delivered a sleek, functional book club website complete with a featured books section that even has some animations whenever I hover my mouse over it. And then we got meeting tools, call to actions, contact forms, etc. And I didn't have to write a single line of code. There's even separate website pages that you could check out and click on and interact with various aspects of the site. Again, this is amazing. Didn't have to write a single line of code. Deep Agent was able to create this with one simple sentence text prompt. Amazing. And check this out, it even has a light and dark mode that you could toggle on and off here in the navigation menu. Again, this is amazing. Just from one text prompt, we're able to tell the deep agent to create a fully functional website. Call me old fashioned, but this is crazy. Then if you wanna deploy your site and make it live, simply click the deploy button in the upper right corner of the workspace, and then you'll be given two options for publishing either an abacus provided subdomain or you could use your own custom domain. For simplicity and speed, I'm gonna go with the free subdomain option. You'll just type in your preferred name there. And in this case, I'm using between the pages for the subdomain and then click deploy when you're ready and abacus will take care of the rest. Now, once again, this took about two minutes to fully deploy. So you'll need to sit here and wait while it finishes up. But for the sake of time, I'm gonna fast forward really quick then once the deployment is successful, you'll see a confirmation message and a live link to your new site. And then click that URL and it will open your fully deployed project in a new browser tab. And from here, you can view and interact with your site just like any visitor would. However, after reviewing the live site in the browser, I noticed some minor spacing issues. Now, you'll obviously want to catch these before you deploy, but I digress. So the first issue I see is below the main headline. The text felt a bit cramped and could use some extra padding beneath that. And then also in the title and the footer on the left-hand side of the screen could use a little extra padding as well. So this is yet another one of Deep Agent's amazing features. We can actually go back and chat with it and make the updates with simple text prompts. So check this out. Like I said, you don't need to touch a single line of code. Just open the chat interface and then type in a natural language request like add 10 pixels of padding below the Between the Pages book club heading on the homepage. The AI understands the request and applies the updates in real time. So whenever I sent this through, this update did take a couple minutes to process. So once again, I'm gonna fast forward during this portion of the tutorial, but just know that it's still light years faster than if I had to manually code these changes on my site. And then once the change is made, you can instantly see the improvement. There's now a nice bit of space under the heading giving the layout a cleaner, more balanced look. And with that fixed, if you recall, I also spotted a similar issue in the nav and the footer. 
The site title between the pages was sitting too close to the edge. Again, I used the Deep Agent chat to request add 10 pixels of padding to the left of the between the pages title in the navigation menu and footer. And whenever I sent this through, again, this took a few minutes to process, so I'm gonna go fast forward through this really quick. And just like that, our site looks more polished and visually aligned. Then you'd obviously need to deploy the changes again in order for them to display on the front end of your site. So just click that deploy button again and assign it to this domain. But this kind of real-time editing with natural language commands makes fine-tuning your site incredibly efficient. You don't have to dig through style sheets or write CSS. It's all handled behind the scenes so you could stay focused on your content and design vision. All right, next, let's go over how to manually initiate a new task with Deep Agent. So we'll go back to the main prompt interface, and to do that, just click that pencil icon in the upper left corner. This brings up a new input box where you can type a brand new request. So for this example, I'm gonna create a PowerPoint presentation on how to start a WordPress.org blog. And then once again, we'll submit that prompt through, and Deep Agent will respond with a few follow-up questions to tailor the result. And here it's asking me whether I want a beginner-friendly version, if it should include hosting and cost info, and how many slides I want. And just like before, we'll provide our answers in the chat box there at the bottom. And then send those through. And DeepAgent will then begin to create a text preview of your presentation. This is essentially a text outline of what will be included in the final presentation. And the images will be notated with a placeholder, but once it's done with the text preview, Deep Agent will ask you to review and approve it. And if everything looks good, which it does, I'm just gonna approve this first draft. We'll type yes in that chat field and send it through. And Deep Agent gets to work creating the final presentation, which again, took a few minutes to fully process, but I hope you're starting to see the power of having a tool like this. Pretty amazing in my opinion, and there are a ton of use cases. As it's running, it will eventually ask you to choose a design style as shown here. So keep your eye open for that. And from that drop down, you'll select a template. And I'm gonna use Modern for this example. And then click Submit to submit that selection. Then this final time frame of the Deep Agent processing the request and designing the template took about three and a half minutes. So I'm obviously fast forwarding through this, but just be mindful of that whenever you're working on your projects. Then when it's finished, you'll get a confirmation in the chat that it's done, and then you'll see a preview of the presentation on the right-hand side of the screen. From here, you could use the built-in slide viewer to cycle through your deck and review the finished product. Everything from the structure to the visuals will be generated for you, ready to download, present, and even customize further. And remember, you can continue making edits to the presentation if you'd like within the chat, but for the sake of time, let's go over how to export this actual presentation file to use. So in the upper right corner of the preview screen, you'll see a few icons. This gives you full control over how you interact with your generated presentation. First, the computer monitor icon allows you to view your slides as if they're being presented on a desktop. It's a great way to get a feel for the final visual flow of your presentation. Next to that is the download icon. Clicking this icon will export your file and automatically begin the download to your computer. To the right of that is the drop-down menu labeled PPTX. This lets you choose the file format for your download. By default, it's set to export as a PowerPoint file, but you could switch to PDF if you prefer a static document. Finally, all the way on the right, you'll see a toggle that switches between code and preview. This allows you to jump between viewing the underlying code and the live visual preview of your presentation. Then once you're ready to export your presentation, simply click that export icon in the upper right corner of the interface, and this will trigger the export process using whatever file format that you've selected. And then keep in mind, you'll see the red icon appear near the bottom of the screen while Deep Agent is preparing the download. And then once it's ready, the file will automatically download to your device and also appear in the chat panel on the left-hand side of the screen. Then if you want to return to the live preview of the slides after downloading, just click the purple file name box that appears above the file and that'll bring you back to the interactive slide view where you can continue reviewing or making changes if needed. And that's gonna wrap up this tutorial. 
As you just saw, we were able to create a fully customized website and a PowerPoint presentation in a matter of minutes using Deep Agent. And honestly, this is just the beginning. We barely scratched the surface of what this tool can do, from generating entire websites to building technical reports, apps, and so much more. Deep Agent is opening the door to a whole new way of working. It's fast, intuitive, and requires very little effort to produce high quality results. So whether you're a creator, a freelancer, or just someone looking to streamline your workflow, this tech is gonna change the game. All right, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. So that's gonna do it for this video. If you found it helpful, I'd greatly appreciate it if you would like, comment, share, and subscribe to the Blog With Ben YouTube channel. Also, if you're looking to start a blog, check out these two videos on how to build, grow, and monetize a WordPress blog. They'll walk you through the entire process step by step. And as always, your support means a great deal to me and my family, and for that, I thank you. So with that being said, I'll see you in the next video, and thanks for watching.